Hi, Jamie. Um, I'm going to take the video today, as you had requested, of some of the um, products that I've been working with to show you where we're having some errors. Now, I'm going to show you the flawed designs that came out um, that I'm going to try to fix myself. Uh, and that should give you some idea of what I'm seeing, some of the issue I'm having. Um, bear with me one second. I'm going to try to change the view here, which I'm not having an easy time doing. Okay. So these are my products. Uh, we, I don't know if you could see these. Um, you know, they're already on the materials. This one, I have some issues here with the bow. You know, a lot of the issue comes in the alignment. The larger designs are not as frequent as the smaller designs, but this one, I'm missing the stone. Um, you know, this one is a little, the alignment's a little off there, a little off here in two places. So, you know, this one also, I have an issue right here, one right here. Some of them are not as bad. I can still try to sell the products. This one though, the bow's off. That's a bit noticeable because it's on a pink background. You know, my alignment's off right here and right here. Now the designs seem to look good on paper. They seem to be moving under the press. This is another issue here. Issues here in the alignment. I'm missing a stone, probably stuck to the paper. Um, you know, this one right here is an issue. I'm also missing a stone in the eye. They And one here, they tend to get lost. Um, now this one I kept the plastic on because when I lift it, the stone sticks. You see it's right there sticking. A um, little bit of misalignment there. But I am going to try to save these because obviously if I can sell them, I make money. This one, the same thing. The stone lifts. I reapplied them several times. That's not your design. And, you know, I'm still having the same issues. So these are the ones that I'm working with that I'm going to fix on my own. That's not your design. I apologize, Jamie. But anyway, I'm going to get rolling here. So here's my heat press. It's at 400. And here's your designs. Now, they look good here. All right. So it's hard for me to tell which one to use, which not to use. I'm going to go. I'm going to get my shirt, which is here. Okay, I'm going to open it up. Now I'm gonna need two hands, so just bear with me while I put the phone down, okay? I'm gonna open this up. I would have used a different piece of fabric, but I wanna show you exactly what I'm working with and where my issues are. So here's your design. Actually, a couple of these are off in alignment already. This one is not, so I'm gonna choose this one. I'll show you how I'm applying it, how long it's under the press for. And by the way, I appreciate you taking the time. I'm happy to give you any feedback that I can. And I do appreciate, you know, your efforts to work with me. It's not that I don't. It's just the more I apply these designs, the more issues I'm having. And obviously it affects my bottom line. So that's where the issue really starts. So I am applying this going to try to show you as best I can to the shirt okay so I've peeled the back off I'm laying it down I'm placing it where I'd like it all right and we look good so far so it's on here I'm going to place it under the press which you see is at 400 degrees all right uh, so this is going under nice and flat Design looks good. Okay, these stones are a little off up top, but I realize that somebody else might not. Everything else looks good here, so I'm gonna cover it just to protect it from heat. Okay. Starting the press, starting my timer. 40 seconds, which is typically what I use for every design. So we'll just wait for this to come out and see where we're at. I'll let it cool down in the meantime. I'll show you some of the ones I have had success with. But there are definitely some issues with production here. 
Um, you know, and again, I appreciate all of your efforts. So the timer's gone off, 40 seconds. Take this out, let it cool down. So if you look here, Jamie, the design in the bow is moved over to the side. Again, that's something I noticed. Somebody else might not. But even here, the alignment's off. I think I've showed you some of these pictures. Um, but I am noticing that even when I pull them off and put them under the press, I get movement. So these are the ones that I've had success with. There are some slight imperfections, but I notice them. I'm not sure that anybody else will. But you know, you could see that there. these are the ones, and it's actually more than two or three. I continued to make some last night. But these are the ones I've had some luck with. Even still, it's slight. Like this slight, this is slight in its alignment. Um, this one too, right here. Nobody else might notice that. This one here, slight imperfection. You know, I'm gonna try to sell them. These came out okay, slight imperfection here. But like I said, little one here, maybe nobody will notice. This is the main pile that I'm having issues with. So now I'm going to try to peel this off and show you what we're getting. Um, I'm gonna try to do it this way so I can let you see what's happening here. This is a lot of where I'm finding the issues. Um, once I take the plastic off of the top. Uh, this is when the stones lift and then I reapply them under the heat. Some of them are crooked. Some of them just don't stick. Okay, so here we have it right here. Stone stuck to the paper right there. Um, I'll continue to peel it off and see if I have any other stones missing. Um, but this is exactly what my concern is. So it's only the one stone, but look, I have movement in the stones here. You watched me apply it under the press. I don't have even spacing in the stones. I'm not sure why this is happening. So I'm gonna reapply this, try to fix this particular one myself. And Jamie, I'm even going to do another one just to show you because, you know, I'm doing this in good faith um, in the hopes that we can, I, I, it's not that I don't want to work with you, I really do, but I'm sure you can appreciate, so I'm taking out another shirt, that my concern is genuine, uh, has nothing to do with you or, um, you know, the way you... Uh, conducted business with me. I mean, I'm very pleased. You do offer me great service. You're very responsive. None of those things are my issue. This is my issue. It really just comes down to strictly business. So I'm going to choose a better design this time. I'm going to try. I'm going to go through my pile. Uh, this one seems to look okay. I'm going to choose this one, Jamie. I'm just going to um, put my phone down so I can cut it out. But I want you to look. These stones all look okay. They all seem to be evenly spaced. Everything looks good. So I'm going to cut this out, do the same thing, apply it to my shirt. And uh, you know what I'll do with this one is I won't put the sheet that I use to protect it from heat. I'm not gonna use that this time. I just wanna show you some of the variations. Um, you know, it, it just, just to answer any questions that you might have. Uh, hey, honey. Okay. Oh, okay. Ow. I'm sorry. Oh, sorry, Jamie. My daughter just got home, so I'm trying to do this. I haven't seen her in a couple days. She was at a friend's house. She came home with a sunburn, so she's in a little bit of pain. So here I'm applying the design, and I'm going to show you even after I put it on the paper, uh, on the shirt. I'm sorry, because this isn't when the stones begin to move seems to be happening somehow under the press, which I'm a little puzzled by. I'm sure you are too. So I'm placing this on the shirt. Okay. So here's the design. Looks good, right? The alignment looks okay. Everything looks even. It's ready to go to the press. It's on the press. Okay. The press is still at 400. 
we're under here again it's even okay lowering this setting my timer for 40 seconds and we'll see how this one comes out I'm not as concerned working with the larger designs because I seem to have more success with them. These are some of the other things I've done. Uh, I wanna show you one. See, this is a larger design on a denim jacket. Looks great. Okay, now here we go. Timer's done. I'm removing it from the press. Okay, everything still looks in alignment. Okay, it all looks good. I hope you can see this clearly. I have my camera flipped, so I'm having a bit of a difficult time seeing what you can see. Um, but there we have it. There's the design. I'm gonna let it cool down a little bit before, and I'm gonna shut my press off because it's very hot. Um, let, let this cool down, see what happens. But these are your designs, Jamie. I mean, I've showed you some of the pictures of the imperfection. I'll show you where I'm storing it. This is a very cool room. So it's not a question of the temperature here, but I store them in a drawer, very organized. You know, they're neatly stacked. Um, you know, and if you look at this one, the spacing and the alignment is already off. So in choosing a design, that wouldn't be one that I chose. But, uh, I'm going to put these back and let's see where we're at. Okay, I'm going to take the design off and we'll see if we get any lifting. If we do, I will turn the phone so you can see. Um, okay. Let's see what we're doing. Okay. So far, so good. Okay, so we got a good design, Jamie. Everything's okay with this one. So, again, though, I still have some movement in these stones. Not sure if you can see it. I don't know why this is happening. But, again, I could try to still sell this one. That might not be obvious to anybody else's eye. But... These are some of my issues. I hope I have given you some good feedback uh, and I appreciate you taking the time to work with me. Um, please let me know if there's anything that I could do if you have any additional questions. Thank you, Jamie. And again, I it's not that I don't wanna do business with you. It's just affecting a lot of my product. This is a lot of time to fix. I'm not running into these issues with other products. It's really just a business decision, but um, you know, I appreciate your efforts. So I'll send this over and let's see what we come out with. Thank you.